I'm Ben with the BTC Sessions, and this is your bullish bit, brought to you by bitrefill.com, the easiest place to shop and get all of your needs met with Bitcoin and Lightning transactions. You can head over here. They've got gift cards from Amazon, Walmart, Steam, Uber, Instacart, Airbnb, Apple. The list goes on, but they have you covered. You can be living on a Bitcoin standard like me, and BitRefill has been a godsend. So head to bitrefill.com and use code BTC Sessions at checkout for discounts. My focus is still on Latin America. And for me, and I guess the rest of the Gen 3 team, we think Latin America is the most interesting place for adoption. There is a, a sea change happening there in terms of politics. And a lot of it has to do with anchoring of El Salvador and then mm. setting the example. So for us, we want to really devote our energy to that region. But uh, on one of my last trips, we were in Argentina and I got to see firsthand how people living under double digit inflation or basically hyperinflation uh, live their lives day to day. You know, you're converting, you're converting money to uh, pay for things like maybe dollars to pesos. And you're, you're basically operating on a just in time models. For, for us, we were converting dollars basically every few days so we could pay for dinner because we didn't want to uh, you know, convert all at once in one batch. And we actually were losing money through the entire time, actually gaining money the entire time. So if we did convert all in one batch when we first arrived, we would have lost uh, by the time we left. But it's just an eye-opening experience going to see that. And I believe it's important for Bitcoiners to go into the world and actually visit other places, much like Jack is saying, you know, until you go there, you, you don't have that full perspective. And a lot of people in the West living in um, Europe, Canada and the US, we're kind of we're kind of very comfortable. We have access to all the tools and financial infrastructure that people just don't have. And it kind of blindsides us to being able to understand the necessity of Bitcoin and other tools such as stable coins or other ways to get dollar denominated value. Having these tools at the disposal of the people in Latin America is a net benefit because it enables opportunities and commerce activity that otherwise would not have been possible. Mm -hmm. so I think